Hi and welcome to another video of your tutorial series. In this video we are going to learn about more about classes. There are two more concepts that are needed for the classes. First is nested class and other is class in conf file. So in previous video we saw that we have created a class with some tasks. So in this video the first what I did is I created and other task info bb class so and here you can see that i have inherited the task info into this class it means that the all the information all the uh, all the information all the tasks all the functions in this classes in this class are now can be found in this class also and can be accessed through this class <coughs> furthermore I have added here one more task called do between up unpack and patch. So and I added this task to between do patch info and do unpack info. It means that if we add this class into our this bbb example dot bb file and if we run this If we run it big pvb example so we should also see now this in between the patch info and the unpack info so let us see what happens Now as you can see that between the unpacking of PVB example and patching there is one more message called I am between unpack and patch. So this is the first concept that we see that we have seen that we can also nest the class. If we would nest this uh, task uh, info 2 into an other class so that other class will inherit all the functions variables tasks of this class and the, this main class so the second concept is <coughs> how to use this inherit in local dot conf or any other conf file so to see that the if we are using the if you want to use the class in any conf file i am saying any conf file right now I, we are using local dot conf but in the future videos we will see some other conf files for example here local.conf so the syntax here is instead of using a small inherit like in bb class we, we in bb we have b file we have a small inherit in bb classes class we also have a small inherit but in this conf file we must write inherit in capital plus equal and the name of the class in inverted commas so here we are using this task info now the task info to class so if we now build this class will be added to each and every package that is going to be installed in our image so if i run right now it pick core image full command line So we can see that so as you can see that now the task all the task info that we have uh, created here is going to install or, or is going to execute for each and every package that is going to install in our image file so right now you can see there are a lot of patches patching going on for a lot of tasks uh, a lot of uh, packages so
so this is all about this video and now i will see you in the next video in next video we are going to start some more advanced topics so thank you for watching and please like and subscribe my channel and see you in the next video